Friday afternoon at the 240th fish fence, 26 degrees out. Ross here with Steph and friends, of course. We have our 55 chum salmon fry, and they are raring to go, and so are we. So they start their ocean journey just like that. As we think back to January when they first came to the school, and it all comes down to this. Joining them is, I don't know if you can see there, there's a whole big school of sticklebacks. They're an anadromous fish. They can live freshwater or salt. They got about a two year lifespan. And they all kind of compete for the same food resources. The difference is the chum are leaving here for the ocean pretty quick. Is that a better view? That looks just fine. I'm gonna watch them swim on out. They kind of like it in that bucket. You do. Let's see if I can tip it a bit more. Definitely not in a hurry. I think maybe they were too happy in school. They were happy. They were great. I'm waiting for the first one. I've never, I've never had them not swim out before. So, historical moment we've got here, folks. The slowest ever chum salmon fry release. Oh, there, oh, no, one went and went back in. Oh, there we have one there coming out go. now. Oh, there they go. And we're off to the races. So they're quite easy to see at the moment. That will change. They're going to change color to match their surroundings as off they go on the next adventure. Heading off into the weekend on the eve of goodbye chums tomorrow. So Ross from the fish fence.